So you want to create an animated scoreboard in Minecraft? Well, stay tuned. So first of all, we need to actually create our first scoreboard. Type in scoreboard objectives add v1 dummy and the text. We're going to put this as yellow and it's ncv here. Close off the string, submit the command. Okay, we've created v1. Now we're going to copy this exact same thing for v2. So you guys can see that I've actually changed, I'm shifting the colors. You guys can animate it any way you want, like you can change the text, you can change the colors, you can change anything you want, but for mine I want to simply go from yellow to a gold color, or orange color. Don't forget, you need to change the V, so you, that's, uh, think of it like a keyframe. So the first keyframe, I'll be yellow, and the second one, which I'm going to change it to the second one, the its would be yellow, uh, its would be gold, and then the MCB would be yellow. And then V3. Change that. Here would be yellow. And then go with 4. And then it would all be gold. Perfect. Now we have the four keyframes, as I'll call them. Something very important to consider is taking areas. Taking areas are defined chunks that will constantly stay loaded even if players are far away. This will ensure the commands to animate it will always be working. I like making my area into a box so I can visually see my limitations. I'm going to get some red wool out. I'll make a bit of a box right here. Alright, so make sure to have your uh, game rule show coordinates true. This way you can uh, actually define the ticking area. You need to have the coordinates. And right, so type in ticking area, add. Now you can do a rectangle or a circle. Rectangle is the XYZ to another XYZ. The circle is add circle in the center of the circle. Most people add it as a circle. It's really easy to add it as a circle, but for me, I'm a bit particular. I like to have it as a rectangle. Coordinates are 0, 75. See? See my position right now? That's exactly what I put into this. So that's the first coordinate. We need to go down over here. And then, okay, negative 8, 64, negative 1. Negative 4, 68, negative 1. Did I do that right? Nope, negative 8, 64, negative 1. I was close. I switched up the number. Okay, boom. Now I submitted the command, and now we have one ticking area. All right, so what I've just done is I've just made a redstone clock. It is a bit gimmicky, but <laughs> it's all right. I'm just going to take a redstone block. Boop. And now I've set it off. Now the... Uh, now I've just set up, okay, now I've just set off my redstone clock, so these command blocks are constantly going off. So now we're actually going to make it so we can see our animated scoreboard. So in the command block, I'm going to type it out here so you can see it a little bit better. Scoreboard, objectives, set display, sidebar, and then V1. Okay, boom, we have the first thing there and that's absolutely awesome. I'm going to say this one is V1, V2, V3, and V4. What I just did there is added a hover note. Hover notes are really, uh, are actually really useful because you don't actually have to go into the command block to see the command. You can just see, oh yeah, this one's V1, this one's V2, this one's V3, uh, and so on and so forth. So now I'm just going to put that command in here. I'm going to do the exact same thing here, but change the V1 to V2. Do this one to V3, and do this one, V4. Now, check out our sidebar. How cool does that look? It's changing color. Now, you're going to see a, a, a pretty big problem here, and that's that there's a command block output. You're going to want to set that to false. So, game rule, command block output 
Output, <laughs> output false. There you go. So now you're not going to get any more spam in chat. You can see, no more spam. All right. So this is all nice and dandy, but we want to add text below it, don't we? Of course we do. So what we're going to want to do is type in scoreboard players add and the string. So let's say under that, it's a realm. Let's say it's a realm. You're going to say realm code demo. Close off the string and say for v1 and then add 1. So that has to be a score of 1. All right. Awesome. So now you're going to see an instant problem where it's going in and out. That's really easy to fix. You just need to type in the exact same thing for v2, for v3, oops, v3, and for v4. Now we constantly have that. And you can add even more lines. So let's say you're going to put this for v2, and we're going to say, enjoy your day. Actually, we're going to get a color code here, so I'm going to make this one green. So dude, instead of that, it's going to be that. Okay, for V1, that's going to be line 2. There you go. Enjoy your day. We're going to set that V2 as well. For V3. And for V4. All right, awesome. So now we have It's MCB here. Enjoy your day, run code. And then it's just demo because this isn't actually a realm. Thank you for watching. I hope this video was informative and helped you create an awesome scoreboard. Please send me a video or, or picture of your animated scoreboard on Twitter or tag me on Instagram. Also, if you want me to teach you anything else, leave your suggestions in the comments section. Have an amazing day. God bless you all. And I'll see you later. Bye. <laughs>